Hi everybody, welcome back to Bimal Sarji YouTube channel. Now I am going to solve exercise 8.3, question number 10b. Through what angle does the hour hand of a clock turn in 30 minutes? Express the angle in radian. So, what we have to do now? So, what angle does the hour hand? So, our hand. So, our, our hand means what? In 12 hours, in 12, in 12 angles, in 12 hours, in 12 hours, the angle made by, the angle made by our hand, our and is equal to how much? Because in 12 hours, the hour hand will take one complete rotation, okay? It will take one complete rotation. That means angle from here to here is 360 degrees. So this is 360 degrees. And now, 12 hours will change into how much? Minutes, because we have to find 30 minutes. So we have to change this 12 hours into minutes. So 12 hours in means what? 12 so 60 divided this, this 60 multiplied 12. So this is how much? 12, 6, 72 and this is okay. So 720 minutes. 720 minutes. The angle made by our hand is equal to how much? Now, in one minute, Beta, beta, ne maro ne, lagi the na. Uni chal ja. Ora jani baj ne maro, baj pe tu bati karu. Or tok pe ne karu. Tok pe ne karu ora. In one minute, in one minute the angle made by our hand is equal to. Is equal to in one minute how much? 360 degree divided by this 720. Why? Because in 720 minutes, 360 degree, that means in one minute there will be what? Less degree. So for less we have to divide by this. So this is means 0, 0 cancel. There will be 1 by 2 degree, okay. Now we have to find in 30 minutes. So in 30 minutes, the angle made by is equal to, this is 1 by 2 degree into, this is 30 into, why we into? Because in 1 minute there is half degree. That means in 30 minutes there will be more degrees, so we have to multiply by this. So this will be how much? 30 multiply. So this will be how much? 15. So there will be what? 30 divided by 2 is 15 degrees. Okay? So this is 15 degrees. So we got that in 30 minutes the angle made by how and is equal to how much? 15, min, uh, 15 degrees. Now express the angle in radian. So we have to now convert this into radian. We know 180 degree is equal to pi radian. This is our formula. So 1 degree is equal to how much? Pi divided by this 180 radian. That means 1 degree. This much radian. So for 15 degree we have to write it 15. Degree is equal to this. Multiply this 15 with this. So pi by 180 radian. So when we when we divide this by 3, we will get a 5. When we divide this 18 by 3, we will get a how much? 6. And this 0 here, okay? So 60. And 5 ones are 5 and 2 and 5 are 60. So 15 degrees is equal to how much? Pi by 12. 
radian, okay? So the required angle in radian, therefore the required angle, okay? You can write this is the answer, you can write here, therefore the required angle in radian is equal to how much? Pi by 12 radian. This is our solution. If you have any doubts in this step, please feel free to comment in the comment box. You can check the Vimal Sarji playlist to get much more videos, tricks, mathematical tricks and solutions up to class 12. See you in the next videos. Radhe Radhe. Jai Sri Krishna.